Hello, this is Ron Mahotra. I hope you're having a nice day. Today I want to take the opportunity to talk about why conformity kills your inner power. When you're born, you're born with a unique blueprint. You are unique with a personality signature like no one else's. No one in the history of the world has the exact combination of personality traits, strengths, values, passion, purpose and goals as you and no one ever will. Naturally, we're all born with a risk-free and assertive nature. When we think about this and we truly realize this, it should really make us feel special. However, the reality is that most people do not feel like there is anything special or unique about them. We are pressured to pursue and consider career paths and lifestyles that are considered prestigious and lucrative. We are conditioned to see work as something that we have to do, as opposed to seeing work as a source of inspiration and fulfillment. We are pressured to be like everyone else, by our parents, by our colleagues, by our employers, by the media, by the education system, through cultural influences, through religious influences. What most people do not realize is that when we succumb to conformity, we lose all of our inner power and uniqueness that makes us different. When we do this, we inadvertently end up in situations, careers or jobs that are not exactly suited for us. Most people would rather blend in than stand out to avoid being labeled as strange or different. As we get older, we become fearful of being an individual and living in full expression of ourselves. And research shows that living in this way can be detrimental to our well-being. The consequences are severe. No sense of inner power, disconnection from personal gifts and talents, chasing material success as opposed to inspiration and fulfillment, having no passion in life and just experiencing satisfaction on a temporary basis, following others blindly resulting in diminished self-esteem, feelings of constant anxiety and frustration. It is time that people wake and up and start placing importance on what truly matters. And what truly matters is what you really want. And you can only know what you truly want if you know yourself. And the only way to know yourself is to fully be yourself and go inside and listen to what's in your heart. Have the courage to be your unique self because you're going to live this life only once.